Morning, everybody. Give for yourself a round of applause for standing up. Because you have a lot of people who want to there, but they can't there. Because they have their job. Because they pick their school. Because they're afraid for the government. But they're not afraid for the government. I don't know why the government so no. Because it's the great people's united party. And the losing is over. We are going to start winning elections again. And it starts right here, right now. You know, they say you can't buy one bicycle cat and expect that you can drive like a Prado. You can't put on rats to mind the cheese. You can't put on teeth in charge of the lands department. Because you know what happened, right? You want teeth, and you have plunder, and you care who everything. Well, I am here to say that if the Prime Minister can't do the right thing, then the people of Belize have a responsibility for make him do the right thing. If the Prime Minister can't have a full, thorough, independent investigation into all his called over at the Lands Department under Mr. Vega, then it is the responsibility of the people to make him do it. If he is not prepared to do it, then he needs to get out of the way. And if he is not going to get out of the way, then the people should move him out of the way. You see? You see the situation here? This is not like a thief for a million dollars. This is the lands of this country. This is our finite resource. We don't want to get more land. God no one give you more land. And if you're up to the Guatemala government, we will have less land. So when the UDP ministers double up all the land and carry all the land home, Placentia land, Comoros Bike land, San Pedro land, Ramsey Key land, Cayo District land, Mountain Pine Ridge land, carry all the fine properties home. You know what they do? Then they condemn your children and your grandchildren and your unborn grandchildren to poverty for the rest of their life. Meanwhile, the ministers have been a picnic, have been a grand picnic, have been a unborn grand picnic set for the next 150 years. Now we know that this is very normal. But you don't have no right to be free land. Corruption now changes in this country, you know. If somebody not go to jail, if somebody not go to jail, and that's what we need to do. We need to ensure that we don't stop here. This march is just the beginning. You can't be with Konya and feel good and walk and talk and pat one another on the shoulder and then we we'll forget about this. No, no. We can't forget about this. We have to work for this. We have to be prepared to make sacrifice for this. Because the lands of Belize are for the people of Belize, not for the UDP. So we have to stand up and be counting and prepared to go the extra mile. But anyways, no like attacking. No like attacking. Thank you for coming, and we will continue to do what we do. I love you all.